हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू आई एम गेट अकेडमी माई सेल्फ संदीप पटारी एंड माई नेम इज विपिन मिश्रा एंड वी वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन द आई एम एस गेट अकेडमी प्लेटफॉर्म एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एज पर द गेट स्कोर दैट यू आर गेटिंग एंड द मार्क्स यू आर गेटिंग एज पर दैट मार्क्स वॉट आर द डिफरेंट अपॉर्चुनिटीज दैट यू कैन एक्सप्लोर विथ योर मार्क्स सो इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द डिफरेंट अपॉर्चुनिटीज अवेलेबल सो वी हैव अपॉर्चुनिटीज इन टर्म्स ऑफ आई एस सी आई आई टीज पी एस यूज एन आई टीज सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज एंड स्टेट गवर्नमेंट कॉलेजेस ओके सो एज पर द मार्क्स वॉट आर द डिफरेंट अपॉर्चुनिटीज यू कैन अवेल एंड वॉट आर द डिफरेंट मार्क्स रिक्वायर्ड फॉर दोज सो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट ऑल दोज थिंग्स इन दिस वीडियो सो संदीप सर कैन यू स्टार्ट विद आई एस सी सर पीपल हु वॉन्ट टू परफॉर्म हायर एजुकेशन इन इंडिया यू नेम द ब्रांड सिविल इंजीनियरिंग मैकेनिकल और इलेक्ट्रिकल एवरी वन हैज द ड्रीम टू स्टडी देर मास्टर्स इन आई now my dear students let me tell you usually students who are getting high marks definitely they will look for iisc now here if you see here the students if you want to secure masters in iisc you should have a minimum marks of 70 so in some exams if you see like electrical or some other last year we have seen even with 68 marks around we got all india first rank in that case it will be like 60 plus marks so based on the interpolation we can have the marks now coming to the iisc why students want to choose iisc especially for mechanical and civil is the based on the research and development and the kind of opportunities and if you see the lab facilities and how you are going to publish the international journals and this will definitely help you for your higher education even for your phd level so if you talk in iisc structures in mechanical if you talk Uh, design and thermal are very very important branches now coming to electrical in dc vipin sir can you please elaborate on this so student if you want to get into the top specializations like vlsi and electric vehicle into iic it is the fastest growing a south asian university so you need to score the maximum marks in gate exam okay so only the toppers can make their way into iic that is for sure now if we talk about the psu so if you want to get into the psus like power grid bhel ntpc bark isro and so many others bell are also available okay so if you want to get into the psus irrespective of the whatever branch you belong to at least you to you should get 65 plus marks then your way to psus will be guaranteed even you can make your way into some of the psus if you have even 55 or 60 plus marks but in the top psus if you want to get into you have to score at least 65 plus marks and you can uh, take yourself into the safer position now if we talk about the mtech those students who want to uh, do mtech from iits so what would be the safe score for those students sandeep sir See students for do to do M Tech in IITs we should get at least fifty five plus marks. Even if you are getting fifty plus marks also for new IITs you might have a chances. Now if you talk about the IITs if you see IIT Bombay, Madras, Delhi, Karakpur, Kanpur, Roorkee and Gauhati these are the old IITs and for these IITs your marks should be little bit higher uh, because these are the IITs where they have lot of uh, like. labs or uh, if you see the uh, facilities or if you see the incubation centers over there you have lot of opportunities and coming to the specializations in iits or iisc always remember that structures and transportation in civil engineering or design and thermal in mechanical engineering similarly vlsi and power systems and power electronics in electronics and communication now i have a question for vipin sir sir can you please elaborate about the cut off marks for nits and as well as for the central universities well students the top institutes in india are decided by nrif ranking it is national institutional research framework so as per the nrif ranking we can classify institutes in top as per their top ranking okay so whatever ranking they are holding in nrif we can classify them into the top colleges so like that if you want to get into the top nits your score should at least be 50 plus marks okay and then you can make your way into the top nits so if you have scored overall if you summarize if you want to make your way into any iits nits into psus or isc at least your mark should be 50 plus if you want to get into the top specialization if suppose you belong to ec in electrical steam and that is something i too belong to <laughs> so if we talk about ec in electrical student 
So VLSI is the fastest growing area right now in India. It is expected that it will create over 12 lakhs of job in the upcoming 7 to 8 year. So guys, this is the best time. If you will do your specialization of MTech, if suppose this is VLSI, you will become future ready for this area. You can grab the jobs of highest packages and you can get the placement of your choice into top companies like NVIDIA, Samsung, Intel and many more. Similarly, one more specialization is growing nowadays which is electric vehicles. So it is expected that the complete electric electrification of the vehicle industry will be done up till the year 2030. And it is, is the, it is an area which is going to create around 10 lakhs jobs for both mechanical and electrical students. So guys, do your AmTech in electric vehicle technologies, okay? And you can be future ready for this as well. Okay. And if suppose I have one question, Sandeep sir, we are talking about top IITs. We are talking about top NITs, PSUs, IIC. But so many students will be there who are not able to score that many marks. In that case, what they can do with their gate score because qualifying gate itself is a something big, big, big achievement. achievement, isn't it? Most of the students were not able to qualify. Once you have qualified gate exam, you have made yourself distinguished among the crowd. So if you have qualified gate exam, it is not going to be wasted. Okay. So what are the opportunities? If suppose they have less than 50 marks, what are the opportunities they can explore apart from IITs and IITs, PSUs and IC? Yeah, sir, see, see students, once your mark is above 50 marks, Definitely you can get into the old IITs or IISC or PSUs. And but if you see the overall marks wise, we can see most of the students are less than 50 marks. But if your score is less than 50, don't worry. You can get admission into the like uh, new IITs or NITs or state level colleges or central universities. Mm -hmm. Wherever you are getting into, but remember my dear students, you will get a stipend of 12,400 and now I would like to emphasize, like apart from the top IITs and NITs, we have the most important college where you can get into admission. Here if you see, the first one is West Bengal, Jadapur University, Vellur Institute and Anna University in Tamil Nadu or Amrita University and Thapar University. Sir, see, here if you see the NRF, NIRF rankings, 10, 11, 16, 19 and 20. So, my dear students, even though your marks are less, there is no point of confusion. There is no point of degradation. You have also an opportunity to get into the best colleges other than the IITs and NITs. Sir, can you elaborate on the remaining colleges? So, what I can see here that, just see, these top five universities, they have their NRI for ranking uh, below 20, isn't it? So, they are among the top 20 colleges of India, isn't it? So many IITs and NITs are not there in top 20. And apart from these, if you see, Bits Pilani, Jamia Milia Islamia, Siksha Anusandhan, SRM University of Science and Technology, Chennai, and at the end, we have Delhi Technological University. They all are in top 30 institutes. So students, if you are not able to make your way into any IIT or NIT, you don't have to worry. There are so many other central universities and state government colleges are available where you can yeah, choose AmTech as a course and you can you, you should try for getting the specialization of your choice. Ultimately, that's what matters. So if you are not able to go into IT and IT or PSU, don't worry. There are several other institutes available. Okay, and you can aim the, your, uh, your dream specialization in these universities as well. So don't worry. Isn't it, sir? Yes, sir. Sir, let me conclude here. See, students, if your marks is above 50 marks, definitely you will get into IAC. But remember, students, once you are getting into IAC, your skill set, updating your skills is very important. You name VLSA, but you should be aware of the softwares like MATLAB. You name power systems, power electronics also, you should be aware of MATLAB. Similarly, in structures, you should be aware of the softwares like STAD Pro, ETABS, and in transportation, you can say MX Roads, and in mechanical design, you can have the softwares like ANSYS and all, and also in Dharmal. Now, my dear students, why we are looking for IACs, IITs and NITs? Ultimately, the placement is the important matter. So, placements, you will have high opportunity and the kind of job role is like you can get into like minimum average package of 15 to 20 lakhs, you name any branch. You can get a little bit higher, but I am telling you the average package. Now, coming to the like state level college or NITs, 
now in this case also you have the opportunity if you can top in the class definitely you can compare with the students who are pursuing their mtech from the top premier institutes now let me conclude that these apart from these colleges we have some beautiful 10 colleges which i am listing here these are the other colleges like similarly if you see in civil engineering even though if you get 50 marks there is a chance of getting into PSUs, like some of the PSUs like RITES or some of the PSUs like uh, you can say NHA, National Library Authority of India. And remember, my dear students, if you want to explore your opportunities by getting the marks, then Vipinsar will help you how you can come in contact with the IMS Gate Academy and how the mentorship sessions will help you to choose particular specializations and to choose specific college. Can you please elaborate this, sir? Yeah, sir. So we have a dedicated Telegram channel and regularly we are feeding all this information in our YouTube channel through post guidance series. So if you'll join our Telegram channel, you will get an information about all those uh, videos and all that information that we are giving you. Okay. So right now you are wondering with what you can get with your score. So all these answers, we are actually all these questions we are answering in our YouTube channel and we will regularly feed you about all this information if you will join our Telegram group. Okay. So that's how you can uh, take maximum benefit and the description contains the link of this Telegram group. So I will advise you to join it as soon as possible. So my dear students, what we do at IMS Gate Academy is we at IMS Gate Academy offers 800 plus hours of gate classroom coaching and we also provide online coaching and we also provide self-recorded sessions. Now what are the key features or you can say silent features of IMS Gate Academy is we provide the subject wise material, we provide the exercise books which covers level 1, level 2 and level 3 questions. Here these questions also includes MCQs, MSQs and NAT questions and we are coming with a wonderful booklet which, which we call it as Gate Question Booklet which covers 34 years of solutions. In these solutions we are giving you the key pointers for every problem and we are providing you the alternative solutions. Apart from this we are giving you the QR code or recorded videos for the difficult level questions. Now here at IMS Gate Academy, the key success for students is mentorship and doubt My solving. So how these two things are helpful for the students, can you elaborate sir? Yeah, so gate exam is a very long journey. So you may be stuck with the questions like what should be the ideal preparation strategy? What should be the preparation strategy for core subject and non-core subject? How many revisions are advisable? Okay, how to deal a particular subject in which you are not very good. When is the right time to attempt the test series and how it should be attempted. Like that, you must be wondering about all these questions. So for that, IMS Gate Academy is offering you the mentorship sessions. So there you can discuss one to one to one with the mentor of your choice, how you should actually go for these things. And while studying, you will get n number of doubts about any subject and that can stop your growth in the subject. So we are offering you doubt solving sex sessions where you can immediately post your doubt and it will be answered within 24 hours so that your growth in the subject will never stop. So this is how we are serving you. Okay. Sir, see, let me add you one more point students. We are providing 130 plus tests which covers chapter level, advanced level, multiple subject tests and we are providing the all India mock test which will be a replica of gate environment. And remember my dear students, let us conclude like this. Like if you are getting a marks between 70 to 60, 60, definitely you will have high chances to get into PSUs or IITs or ISE. If your mark is between 60 to 50, definitely you will have high chances into IIT or PSUs. Below 50 marks, definitely you have the advantage to get into IITs. But you can look into, seriously look into the uh, old NITs like Tiruchinapalli or Suratkal or Warangal or NIT Nagpur or Kurukshetra. Now see here in this video, our intention is very simple. We want to elaborate you the marks versus the opportunities. Like these many marks I have secured and what are the opportunities. And my dear students, if you want to Explore yourself based on your marks in the link description. Join the telegram group. We are providing the mentorship sessions individually for free and they can come in touch with us and they can come in contact with the experienced mentors who are in, have already pursued their MTECs in IITs and NITs. So all the best for you, my dear students. Vipin sir, can you conclude it? Yeah, so all the best from our side. Okay, we hope that you will get the best in your career. Thank you, Thank you so much.